All right. So, anyway, Ty, um, we love vinyl, right? Yes. And uh, vinyl is important to us because it's historic, and there's so much energy in all these works of art here. See this album right here, Ty? This is Santana Abraxas. And this is the first album that, by the way, Ty is my son. It's the first album I ever purchased. Actually, I think uh, Ani bought it for me. Ani's my mother, by the way. Anyway, and, you know, see the woman on the front? Yeah. Pretty crazy, huh? Anyway, uh, this has that song, Black Magic Woman. You know the song? She's a black magic woman. You know yes. that track? Okay, yeah. Anyway, so a bit, a bit of history here. It's important to us. Now, you see this album right here? Yeah. Who is that? Bootsy. Have you heard of him? Yes. What does he play? Bass. All right. See, he knows. And um, I bet you didn't know this, but back in the day when I was probably about 10 years old, maybe 9, maybe your age, maybe 11. He's 11. And uh, I was in a dance contest with my homies, Dave Santana and this guy called Jose Q, Cuban guy, and an El Salvadorian. And uh, I don't know if we won or not, but we did this thing called pop locking where you, we did, you know, did this thing. Give me five over here. And then you come over here like that. And, you know, we did all that back then to Bootsy anyway. And you know how Bootsy talks? Yeah. How does he go? Oh, yeah, baby. Oh. All right. <laughs> And then over here, what? A picture disc? This would be No Mercy from back in the day. No Mercy, no Mercy is a band from where? From where? Suicidal? From that era, from Venice. It's from the neighborhood. But the cool thing about this, not only was Mike Clark from Suicidal in this band, you know, it's a picture disc. So a picture disc is cool because it has a picture on it. And that's a be beautiful thing about vinyl is uh, you can celebrate the artwork actually on the vinyl itself. And, you know, we're going to jump over here to this. Who is this? Motorhead. Do you like Motorhead? Yes. And who do you like in Motorhead? Lemmy. All right. We love them all, but Lemmy is the king. And, and how would you get this record? I got it for a gift. Yeah. From who? From you. All right. There you go. And uh, anyway, we've got a Weather Report album here. Guess what? we got Rick James in the house, you know. Do you remember what song he sings? Yeah. What? What's that called again? Da, 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 I da, know. Super Freak. Super Freak. See, he knows. And uh, what about this band here? Who are these guys? Metallica. All right. And, and uh, who's that guy right there? Cliff Burton. And, and do you love Cliff or what? Yeah. All right. He rules. Ty's a bass player, too. Anyway, you know, hey, this is a celebration. we got Average White Band. We've got Parliament Funkadelic here. We've got it all. And, uh, and, 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 and probably the best of all, possibly, is? Black Sabbath. And what's your favorite Black Sabbath song? Uh, Iron Man. Okay. Wait. Is that on here? No. No. Anyway, this is a great album. And, uh, and, and anyway. No, it's, uh, it's the Wizard song. You like the Wizard? Yeah. yeah. It's cool, huh? Yeah. Anyway, it's all a celebration and, uh, and bringing awareness to the kids and our youth about music because music is history and it's important. And uh, the beauty of this is Record Store Day is, is really uh, very proactive. Michael Kurtz has been an angel. They're even helping with film, independent film. Uh, my film, Jocko, they've supported making it a uh, um, film of 19, what was it, 2014, actually. And uh, they were very supportive of that whole movement for that film because they support independent arts, music, and also film. So uh, I always want to thank them because they've been completely helpful and wonderful to me and, and, and so many indep independent artists. And that's all. Yeah, okay. Anyway, bye-bye. Say bye. Bye.